Hey guys, it's Rob J here, and in today's video, I'm going to be talking about my colony of Diokama Rogosum. So, as the title suggests, I have mixed two colonies into one with absolute 100% compatibility, no fighting, and they are now one conclusive colony. So, basically, you know the story of where my first colony turned out not to have a gamma gate within it, meaning they were going to grow old and essentially the numbers were going to die off because no reproducing could take place. Well, the shop itself in question, after learning of this unfortunate circumstances, sent out a new colony. Now once I got the colony, I, I looked at them and I was thinking, well this one's now doomed over here to die off, while this one hopefully has a gamma gate and thrives. And then I just started wondering, I wonder how hard it would be, or is it even possible to trick them into cohabitating or becoming one colony. So what it is, I took a worker from one of the, from the new colony and just dropped it into the established doomed colonies outworld. And it immediately grabbed a mealworm and started walking around, pushing the um, the other ants out of the way. The other ants didn't even bat an eyelid, didn't even notice anything was wrong. So slowly but surely I added another new ant to the colony, one every hour and maintained watching it and nothing ever happened. So once I realised that they were okay to work together because after a while the new ants found the nest of the old ants and were in there sorting things out and everything was fine. So, the next day, I mixed the entire colony together and moved them into the new home, which was around the time of the recording of the review on the nest in question. And it's been nearly a month now, and they're absolutely one colony. There is no sign that there were ever two different colonies from two different locations over two different times but I'm glad to say that that is the case they are now one colony so I only have one colony of Diokama and nobody's gonna die out of old age because hopefully this colony now contains a gamma gate and I should start seeing some sign of eggs or um, larvae soon. So when that happens, obviously I'll bring you an update and everything, but let me tell you about them. So we've got one colony and they have been eating well. They really like their mealworms. They like to either eat them out in the outworld, but most of the time about half the pile gets carried straight into the nest. Um, until it's totally eaten and it's or it's old and it gets brought back out and placed what I can only describe as anywhere around the edge. There's no particular dumping site. So I you know I generally have to go in and clean quite often. But as far as uh, drinking is concerned, they like ant nectar um, or other products like it and they're really happy in their new home. So this has been a brief update, just informing you of where the colonies of what's happened to the colonies. And going forward now, I won't be mentioning this again. So going forward, this is now one colony that used to be two. Thanks a lot, guys, and I'll catch you in the next one.